Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a PowerPoint with a picture with a glow or a reflection or, or shadow or something. So, um, first we're going to go to this and if it doesn't have it, just click it and let's go to home. If you haven't already, go to layout and click black. So first of all, I'm choosing Ninja Art Pixel. So you don't have to, and you can pause the video right now if you don't want to. But um, so I leave that to you. Once you're done, you're gonna right click and choose Copy Image, and go to your blank presentation and there. If you do that, it will have black around it, and we just want the character. So there's a really easy trick to do this. If you don't want the black around it, I'm not saying you must, but if you do want the black, just click the the, that, the picture. But if you don't want to, click that, and they should just have the image. Um, I think I'm gonna make it a bit small and we want to make it up in the top. You'll figure out why later. So um, now we want to go to gonna click the character and there should be this new thing called picture format and go to picture effects go to and then lots of things you can try out. I'm first going to show you how to do glow and you can choose one of these glow colors. Let's see we can make it glow green. You like like that pretty cool but if you don't want to there's this thing called more colors and you can make it glow different kind of colors and different shades i'm gonna pick that one cool so um just choose reflection now and make him have a thing and if you look on the bottom there should be this kind of thing on the even if you get an animation picture known as a GIF, it will still show it walking, so or whatever it's doing. So, um, if you don't want that, we can make the reflection always a little bigger. And yeah, perfect. Go on, shadow. Oh, preset looks good. Oh, preset, you you can show different things. Look at that, it looks like a kind of lying on the floor, but um, no presets. Yeah, pretty much, oh no, it's half half. Okay, I think presets is pretty cool, but sometimes they just, um, a bit rude. So anyway, you can choose whatever you have, soft edges, bevel, uh, or bevel, and pretty much, I'll leave that to you. Okay, once you're done, uh, we're gonna. I'm gonna show you how to do something real cool. So you can go on any of these you have, and uh, below every of them, there's this thing: 3D rotation options, bevel option, glow options, soft edges, reflection, shadow preset options, and you can go on that and click that or whatever you like, because they'll be on, all be on for you. Because this is a picture, it's always best to go on this picture icon. Go to picture color and recolor to a whatever color you like. I think it's pretty. This one's pretty cool, but you don't have to. You might think it's not cool, and yeah. Always click that one if you want it to be back to normal. So uh, that's kind of the white if you want a reflection. So we're going to make it that kind of white. We're going to right click again and do that. And I always think it's always not that hard if you do something which is uh, not a GIF or a GIF is basically an animation because in animation you got to pause and adjust and that kind of thing to make sure they're doing the exact same time but when you got the hang of that it's pretty good so okay hang on that and there are other ways you could do for example you could go on one 
and you could make it on pictures a kind of comic strip that would be pretty nice and you can make your own comic strip and powerpoint but for the moment we're just gonna just call it that with its own white reflection so that's pretty much it you can explore your other things like bevel or bevel or rotation or preset or glow but the moment we're just going to pause here and i'll let you explore your own sides <laughs>